it's Paris. So as most of you all know, my dream career is to go into the film industry, which means I need to practice my skills, make short films, try out different shots and lighting, but all my friends went off to college. And as a girl in a small town who was homeschooled, I don't know many people. This brings me to having no resources to film with. And then it hit me, I'm an AG tuber. I have 21 dolls at my disposal to film with. So I grabbed a doll and I went to Film Grab. Film Grab is a website that you can use to find stills from famous movies and it's really helpful studying lighting and angles and cinematography. So this first shot is from Euphoria. I just loved the lighting. What I did was take my camera, set it up, and then I had Aspen laying down on my bed. And then I had a green light on one side and then my natural light using the window on the other side. And this is the shot that I got. All right, this next one I believe is also from Euphoria. I really liked how the lighting was coming from the back, so I wanted to practice that. So I had Viola standing in front of the camera, lined up the shot, and then I had the yellow light, or orange or whatever, behind her in front of the window so that that would suck out the lighting from front and it would all be coming from the back. Okay, this next shot, I'm not sure what it's from, but I really liked the lighting in this as well because there's two different light sources. They're also coming from the back. They're two different colors and I wanted to try this. So I grabbed my dolls and went down to the kitchen. Tried a lot of different lightings. I was kind of limited because the cord was really short. Didn't get it exactly how I wanted. Another shot from Euphoria, I believe. So this one, I actually kind of took the idea and turned it into my own. So I did the camera pulling away by using like a scarf and dragging it. This created a really like empty look. And so I kind of put together a little short kind of with the idea of emptiness. 